everyone it's Sif Thrath and um today hold on I'm sorry if you hear that but um today I'm gonna talk about um competitive for Overwatch now right now this isn't competitive I can't play competitive and the reason why is season 7 is just so so bad it's really bad I don't like it personally I used to like it and I just stopped playing because I mean it's tox toxic and throwers and one tricks and I'm gonna get into all that so let's uh let's talk about um uh let's talk about um throwers throwers now um when you play competitive some people if they know they're gonna lose they're gonna just throw the match or they can rather just leave the match and everybody lose everybody lose as are not not everybody on the the team that's winning but the team that's losing and um like the person that left on the team everybody is going to lose sr no matter what because of that guy who threw the match left the match or whatever and for some reason it's going to take a long time for you know to get someone back or i don't know if it's only that one person that can come back i'm not really sure and it really sucks how one guy leaves and everybody can just throw a match now in this match i'm playing quick play i'm playing diva and I'm, i wasn't even playing my main my main is mostly support i don't really choose dps and that's that's another thing i want to get into dps um people are people in competitive they auto pick dps like that's the first thing they pick and it's so annoying how everybody gets to choose dps they, they could be four dps like last time i got in a match it wasn't competitive but um it was four dps and um one healer and uh freaking widow it, it wasn't even competitive i i know everybody want to play with you know who they like which is completely fine but if you just play competitive you have to pick some you have to pick someone to win like i don't know this is probably a good combo uh genji rosaria um okay that's one two uh, you can have a tracer if they have a tank you can have a tracer so that tracer can just generate her um her ultimate you can have a a good widow not a bad one a good widow you can have a Amara, uh, Mercy, or uh, Ana. I'm really good with Ana. I'm really, really good with her. She is just so amazing at healing, and I, I she's like my number one healing main. But I main support a lot. But um, that's what DPS are. They just auto pick um characters like Genji, ha Genji, Tracer, McCree, um, Soldier, Sombra, and uh, Farah. It's really annoying, and it's really, really annoying. Um, now, another thing I want to point out. Um, what I want to point out. One tricks. Yes, one tricks. One tricks are pe people that just um like. Hmm. I don't. I don't think I was trying to. I don't think I picked him, but his name is um Torbion, right? Now, of course, you can be a one trick and a thrower at the same time. Um, but a one trick is basically, for instance, if I pick, if I play competitive, let's say there's, well, let's say the rounds go up to six and people is telling me to switch, but the only character I'm picking is Mei. Like, I do not switch at all. I, and I'm telling people like, don't, don't worry guys, I can make this work. Even though she's bad on this map, I can make this work and I'm just constantly dying. And that's kind of like a one trick, really. Because um, I'm just not switching and I'm losing and it's because of me. I'm not switching, helping the team out and we don't, and the team don't need a May. They probably need a Zarya, but um, I'm not switching at all. That's kind of like a one trick. I'm saying F you for the team. You're going to listen to me. I want to do this. I want to do that. And you're going to follow me. That's what they're basically trying to do. That's basically what one tricks are do. Like a Bastion, if you're a Reinhardt, you kind of have to go over the bastion and it's it, you got to look it up yourself maybe someone else can explain it better um let's see um i never played season one two three four and five yeah i never played 
no receipt. I only played season six and seven because I got, excuse me, I got this game over uh, summer. And, you know, I was really hyped to play it, I, uh, and I, I I like the game, but it's too much tox toxic in a game, and people is judging you who you pick. Like, I can be the world best widow, and people don't even know. But if I choose widow, people gonna say, "Oh yeah, this kid is strong because he choose widow." So guess what? I'ma throw f you. It, it's really so dumb, man. To tell you the truth, this widow was eh, it was okay, but she was okay. He I don't know. It was okay and um, I have another video coming up it's about how Doomfist is underrated and I was kind of baddish I, 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 it was an okay I did okay I was good I got kills of course and um, I'm gonna get to that when I'm done but um for this one competitive is just not in a good place I wanted to reach top 500 or at least go on um, uh, like Diamond or Grandmaster and I'm still on gold, but I passed my career. I passed my uh, season career, which is good um, Will I be playing season 8? When it drops Oh boy, I have like what 30 20 days for it to drop. I'm not sure But um, no, I don't I don't think I'm playing I don't think I'm will be playing season 8 unless they fix something about the team I heard they're fixing things, and this Lucio was so annoying, like, really annoying. I couldn't kill him. I don't know why. I don't. I guess I'm not, you know, a, a, a good diva. I'm decent. I'd be getting kills left and right, but this Lucio was just so annoying. It's really, really annoying. But um, yeah, competitive. It's not in a good place. I don't like it. I really want to play competitive. So I can get better as a whole, as a team, just you know, talking, talking to people, getting player, getting um, better with my characters. I, and I'm I'm flexible. I'm flexible, but I mostly main support because everybody just choose DPS. Everybody. So I was kind of forced to choose support, and I'm like, you know what? Fine. I I, I guess I can just. I guess this is my main from now on. I'm I'm a support me, and of course, if you know, if people, you know, want to do uh, support, I, I can I can flex. I can be a tank. I can be a defense character. I can be an offense character. It's completely fine. I really really don't mind. And uh, Jeff, please fix Hanto bow, cause Hanto his scatter arrow when he shoots on the floor. It's kind of unfair. I hate it, but um I'm. I'm pretty sure I'm not the only one complaining. <laughs> but um, yeah, guys. Um, this this is uh, Universe Wrath or Shadow, whatever you want to call me. Uh, you can enjoy the gameplay. I'm talking about. I'm not sure if I'm missing anything. I'm really not sure. But um, I, I'm I I probably will be talking about this again later. My um, maybe after the Doomfist video, I'm probably going to be talking about this. But I'm probably going to give you a perspective of a healer and what they have to do. I'm, yeah, I'm probably going to do that. I'm, that sounds like a good idea. <laughs> um, so what I'm talking about is um, I'm going to give you perspectives of DPS, defense characters, tank characters, and support characters. After Doomfist, after when I do the Doomfist, I guess you can say that's a DPS. Yeah, even though he's really underrated, he's really good. But um yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Leave a like if you did. Um if if you guys want me to play competitive, I will. I will make multiple videos on it. But you would not hear me talk because I do not have my I don't have my Elgato. And this is the part, yeah, I was Hanzo and I got the achievement. I'm not sure if you're gonna see it. Uh let's see. Uh I don't no, I don't think I don't think so. But I got an achievement. I got I I don't know what it's called. It's something you kill two people with the bows with scatter error. I got it. I was hyped. I don't even use Hanzo like that. But I was really hyped. <laughs> but um, I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, video. Um, whatever you guys want me to talk about next, I will. Um, I would state my opinion how I like it. And if I don't like it, I'm sorry. But um, yeah. Stay awesome, guys, and enjoy your day. Goodbye.